Genji, you are the new manager of Tottenham Hotspur. A lot of people are surprised. What convinced you to come to this club? Listen up, mate. You know, firstly, I'm delighted um, to become the coaching manager of, of, of the Tottenham Ranger Whites, um, the 27th greatest club in the in the League of Premier League Cups. And, um, you know, of course, it, it'd be nice if I was offered the chance to go to you know, the Blue Moon, Manchester Blues, or the, you know, the Red Rapids of, of Liver Red Pool United, but, or the Gunner Reds. Um, but, you know, the Todd and Ranger Whites came in, and um, I think that Daniel Levy, you know, he's seen what I did to the Crocodile Dundee Dingoes last year, beating them 5 1 away. And um, the Falkirk Falcons and the, you know, the Kilmana Kangaroos. And uh, I think Daniel knows that if you can do that, the. You've got a good possibility of doing a great job here at the Tottenham Ranger Whites. And Big Angie, your first job as new Tottenham Hotspur manager will be to convince star striker Harry Kane to stay. Can you keep him here? Yeah, I've already called an emergency meeting, mate, with Henry Kane. You know, what a soccer kickball, kickball striker forward player that guy is, you know. And I'm going to say to him, Henry, look, you know, my guys at the green and white Celtic hoops... You know, if Glasgow, mind, you know, they were scoring 2,700 goals a game. Um, you know, it, it, we were incredible there, you know, and, um, you know, I could do the same thing for him. And, um, yeah, you know, I'm going to make sure that, you know, I'll sit with him and the, and the guys and, you know, we've got to have go to the Tottenham Beach, uh, do a bit of surfing out there, you know, and, and make sure that the guys have a few crates of Foster's beer. And I know they like a beer, the lads. I mean, I've watched them play last year. They look like they like a drink, you know. I've got to be honest, Big Angie, Mourinho couldn't please them, Conte couldn't please them. Can you deal with the miserable, toxic, moaning Spurs fans, Big Angie? Ah, uh, mate, come on, mate. When, I, can deal with the, I can deal with the Tottenham Ranger White fans, mate. I've been at Glasgow, and the Celtic Green and White Hoop Glaswegians, they, they were... They were... If I can deal with them, mate, I can deal with the Tottenham Ranger Whites. I mean, I used to get cans of iron brew through the back of my head, mate. Honestly, and that's because we conceded a goal at home to the Crocodile Dundee Dingoes. And we were 15 nil up at the time. Um, so I can deal with the Tottenham Ranger White fans, mate. Don't worry about that. Well, I'm sure the Celtic fans will understand you leaving. I mean, you were never, never going to get a bigger opportunity than Spurs, were you, Big Angie? I was offered much bigger jobs, mate, than the Tottenham Ranger Whites. I really was, you know, mate. I've come here because I feel sorry for them, mate. They're the 27th greatest club in the Premier League of Premier Cups. Um, and I was offered two much bigger jobs. The Reds of Akron and Stanley, you know, they came in for me. And I was also offered the chance to go and play a really shady businessman with a very dark past in home and away. But I turned them down to come to the Tottenham Ranger Whites for three weeks. Very true, much bigger jobs than Spurs. And finally, Big Angie, you like your teams to run, so just how important is the XG to you? You know what, mate? I, I don't like the XG. I don't like the XG. I feel they're very tight, you know, around my, my, my nether regions. I prefer double XL. I really do, mate, because when I was at the Celtic Green and White Hoops, you know, continuously, mate, I had to get double XL. I, I was just eating haggis pies after every game celebrating because we win every game um i'm not an xg man i'm a double xl